Hi, I'm Brendan Mills, CEO of RIPCODE. Welcome to the RIPCODE blog brought to you and transcoded via RIPCODE's V4 video transcoding appliance. Today I want to introduce you to RIPCODE and what you'd expect from me and my team on this blog. RIPCODE is a new, innovative transcoding solution that delivers video content to any viewing medium while greatly reducing server hardware, storage, and energy use. But before I get into the technology, let's talk about the market dynamics that brought us here in the first place. As you well know, because you're watching this video blog, internet and mobile video is a rapidly growing market. Think about these numbers. 57% of online adults have watched or downloaded online video, and one in five does so on a typical day. Even more striking, three quarters of broadband users who use high-speed connections, both at home and at work, watch or download video online. Mobile video is rapidly becoming a new video distribution platform, with revenues growing over 198% year over year. As consumers demand anytime, anywhere video content, a process called video transcoding becomes a critical part of the network infrastructure for broadcasters, content syndicators, operators, and user-generated video websites. To put it simply, video transcoding is a process of converting files from one format into another. Just about every video you view on the internet or your mobile phone has been transcoded, often several times over. Now, the amount of video that's repurposed or transcoded onto websites, mobile phones, or other formats is growing exponentially, and therein lies the challenge. Today, video transcoding is processed using software solutions that run on servers. However, servers are expensive, slow, and utilize a disproportionate amount of power and space to keep up with the volume of videos uploaded daily. Today's top video operators have to support hundreds of homegrown transcode servers each to process the backload of videos waiting to be repurposed. All this brings us to where we are today, gearing up for the official launch of RIPCODE. I founded the company in 2005 because I was intrigued by this challenge and saw an opportunity to develop a disruptive technology that changes the way internet video is prepared and distributed. In 2004, after reading an article in Wired Magazine from Chris Anderson, about the long tail effect on digital content, I was intrigued about how the industry would handle all the required video formats for the millions of video files that the internet would produce if the long tail effect was to indeed come true. I founded RIPCODE under the premise that we could build a better solution to handle this onslaught of internet based video. RIPCODE's V4 video transcoder repurposes video into multiple viewing formats for PCs, smartphones, mobile phones, iPods, you get the idea. RIPCODE supports stream-to-stream, file-to-file transcoding within a single appliance, giving viewers an expansion of content choices while reducing server hardware storage and energy use. In addition, RIPCODE will announce a new methodology for handling video transcoding when we launch on September 17th. The RIPCODE V4 is an appliance-based transcoding solution, and we're the first company to address video transcoding as a network appliance. Using best-in-class DSP technology, we designed the RIPCODE appliance to process multiple concurrent transcode paths, which significantly speeds the entire transcode process. In the future, I'll invite our engineers to explain this in more detail in upcoming posts. Our team at RIPCODE has been operating in stealth mode over the past 18 months to develop, test, and refine the RIPCODE solution. And I have to tell you, we haven't been this excited about new technology in a long time. The current need is incredible, and we believe no other company is approaching the solution in the same way. We're staying busy here at RIPCODE. We just received our second round of venture funding. We're gearing up for our official launch on September 17th and the announcement of several high-profile customers. You'll see a new website in the coming weeks, but I encourage you to go ahead and sign up for a launch alert email, subscribe to the RIPCODE blog, and join the conversation. I'll share updates here, and other people in the organization will stop by to share their point of view. But we want to hear your questions, suggestions, and ideas. So please leave a comment or send me an email. I'm excited about RIPCODE's unveiling and will share more in the upcoming days. Thanks for watching.